Hi, I am Dr. Banerjee, head of the shoulder and upper limb division, Sakra World Hospital, Bangalore. Sports related shoulder problems can be acute in the form of a single event injury which will lead to either a dislocation or a fracture or a tear of muscles. This is one group. The other group is a repetitive small amount trauma or a micro trauma over a prolonged period of time. This is very common in professional sports who involved in one particular kind of activity, say for the people who involved in overhead throwing or people who involved in javelin throwing or people who are involved in racket sports. They are prone for a chronic repetitive injuries of the shoulder joint. People who are involved in overhead throwing activities need to generate a significant amount of force by bringing their arm into extreme abduction that is the position of throwing into extreme position of throwing and generate the force to throw the ball. In that mechanism what happens is the structures on the anterior side of the shoulder joint that is structures in the front of the shoulder joints are stretched and fellow athlete is not really physically not tuned up or if it is core muscles are weak there might be significant amount of stress on the shoulder joint which will lead to injuries inside over a period of time such injuries are called internal impingement syndromes so what happens in internal impingement syndrome is there is an excess stretching of the tissues on the anterior aspect and the shoulder muscles and inside the joint and the labrum will touch at a certain at a particular point of contact and that repeated activity will lead to small tears of the structures inside the shoulder joint that is called internal impingement syndrome so these patients will have difficulty in throwing or will have a reduced strength of throwing and they will have stiffness of only particular range of movements for say example there might be loss of internal rotation of the shoulder joint so these are called internal rotation deficit shoulders other group of people are called uh, throwers or javelin throwers where they are prone for injuries of the superior labrum that is called slap lesions. So slap lesions causes chronic pain and lack of strength of the shoulder joint in professional sports. So these people need a proper rehab to deal with initially. So most of them they do well with the rehab and people who already have a structural damage into the shoulder joint might need some endoscopic repair of those tissues which will eventually help them in rebuilding their strength and getting back to sports.